this is going to be chapter number three the video number one of grade six science subject and it's going to be a new chapter and it's about water as a natural resource and we will look another beautiful introduction to this water as a natural resource before that we will see what we will learn in this session what you will learn in this session what are the physical states of water we will understand what are the physical states of water shall we get into the subject Water is the most important natural resource given to us by nature. Water is the most important natural resource given to us by nature. As soon as you hear the word water, what do you think? As soon as you hear the water, what do you think? Look at this. A river will come to your mind. A river will come to your mind. Or a stream, little stream like this will come to your mind. Or a pond, a beautiful ponds will come to your mind. Or else, wells. The girl is taking water from the well and that will come to your mind. So, water is commonly found in which state? A liquid state. You will see all this form of water is in a liquid state. Isn't it? Now, does water exist only in the state of liquid? That is a question. Does water exist only in the state of liquid? Let's do the following activity to find it whether the water is available in other states also. Now, identifying the states of water. You will need some ice cubes and a test tube and then a burner you need. So, we are going to do this experiment. Let's understand that experiment. Alright, identifying the water the states of water now we will take this apparatus and exactly what you're going to do you have want to have a clock timer also right it can be observed that when ice cubes are heated then turn into liquid water when further heated what will happen you see right the water turns into vapor water turns into vapor so the three forms are happening first of all it was solid ice cube and then it becomes water liquid and then after that the water vapor had come and all the water is gone away wow so hence water exists in three physical states as look at this ice and then after that water liquid water and water vapor so we understood that three states isn't it so ice as solid will convert when you are heating into liquid, liquid water and further when we are heating it will go away as water vapor that is a gas, solid, liquid and gas state. So solid, liquid and gas state are the state of water. We understood that one. Now we know what are the physical states of water. Solid, liquid and gas solid is ice cube yes liquid is water and the gas is water vapor that's all for the session and i'm going to meet you in another session video number two till then bye bye and take care of yourself